right, what is up you beautiful people? Today, you're coming on a ride with me to Costco. We're actually gonna be grocery shopping on a motorcycle today. I only need to get a few things. I gotta get uh, eggs, a bag of oatmeal, and a bag of granola. So, nothing too big, but it should all fit in my little backpack back here. Um, gonna go ahead and get started now since it's warmed up. So I got, I have two bags. Um, this one I have on now uh, is a little bit bigger than the new, uh, the new one that I have. But the new one I have um, is waterproof. So you kind of win some, you lose some. I got the new bag, um, not just for the waterproofing, um, also mainly because the, the bag I have on right now is my old one. It's kind of falling apart, a little dirty. Um, my handle, you know, the usual handle in the middle that you pick up the bag by, um, is, it broke. So it's a pretty old bag. It lasted a while, but I have it just for now, in addition to my other bag, because you can never have too many bags, you know? You never know when you're gonna need another bag. And this one's a little bit bigger, so. I'm gonna try to make this video not too long. The Costco isn't too far away either, so it's right down the road here. Uh -oh. Oh, oh, oh! I got the front wheel up a little bit on that one. Yeah, I, I accidentally did a wheelie back there. Uh, yeah, it's crazy. And this light takes forever, so I'm just gonna sit here and wait. I feel so weird having like an empty bag on my back. I'm so used to having stuff in it. Like my new bag, or what I usually have in my bag um, is my, you know, my bike lock, my, um, like the U-lock for the brakes. Not, not the U-lock, the, the, the brake disc lock. Um, I have a U-lock, a chain lock as well. Um, just some basic security stuff and stuff to have for the bike. In case I go anywhere I need it, um, I just pack everything in my bag that I could possibly need. What else do I have in there? I think I have, um, I usually carry gloves in there as well, like a spare pair of gloves. Um, I think that's it. Oh, and I keep a phone charger in there too, like one of those uh, mobile, um, like battery charging things, like those uh, the battery packs. I also have one of those too. <clears throat> and I guess this is kind of like a follow-up video for my last one that I uploaded, uh, if you haven't seen it. Uh, the uh, pros and cons of a motorcycle, on um, dailying a motorcycle. This is definitely one of them. <laughs> this is definitely one of the cons, but I love it. I mean, I, I love dailying this thing. It's treated me so well. I have, I have no complaints, honestly. I mean, as bad as it is, like annoying as it is, um, shopping and grocery shopping on a bike, I don't entirely mind that much. It's a lot of fun to just get out and have an excuse to go ride for a little bit. Yeah, I have low gas too. I should probably get gas while I'm here, but the gas lines always take forever. Like the, the line to get gas at Costco is just way too long. So I don't even bother. I mean, you save a little bit of money getting gas here, but in reality, it's, I don't even care. It's nice when it's not busy as heck, but it usually is, so it, uh, it is what it is. Oh, the line's not too bad, actually, for gas. Oh, maybe, maybe I'll get a gas after um, I get my stuff. I'm surprised the line isn't that long. It's like every time I come here, the line is just like, there's a line out to the road. If everyone wanted me to get gas, I don't get it. Uh, now the fun part is actually trying to find a parking spot. That's not light years away from the entrance. Oh, did he just back up? Yes. Thank you, Kia. Look at that. Look at that. Prime real estate, right? Oh, oh my god, there's two of them! Oh, how beautiful is this? All right, I'm about to unload and uh, head into Costco. So 
I will catch you guys on the flip side and show you how I pack it all in my backpack. All right, so I just got done pretty quick in and out. So this is gonna be a point of view. You're loading groceries into a backpack. So as you can see, empty. I keep this one empty because it's my old one, like I said. So you just slide these bad boys in here. I should probably cushion it actually with something, but that's all right. All right. Look at that, everything fits nice and snug. Easy. Snug as a bug in a rug. Look at that. All right. And then like a good citizen, we're gonna return the cart because that's what good citizens do. And off we go. All right. No fuel, yeah, I know. Oh well. It's gonna get gas, but nah. I'll get it tomorrow morning before work. Now we wait. See, I would try to open my visor to defog it. That would be the logical thing to do. But, but you see, I have an Icon Air Flight helmet, so the camera is actually attached to the visor. So if I lift it up, you guys will be looking at um, a bunch of clouds. Um, that's no fun, so. But I can still see, so no worries. Finally. Starting to feel a little rain, but it's only a drizzle, so nothing to be concerned about here. Just a wee little drizzle. I don't know if you could see, maybe the camera got wet, I don't know, but there's some raindrops on the windscreen there. Hot brakes, hot brakes, hot brakes. 